Hi everyone, I am Dylan J, the author of jmr.com. Today, I will show you how to create Rise API using Node.js, Express.js, Mongoose.js, and MongoDB in an easy and effective way. Node.js, Express.js, Mongoose.js, and MongoDB is a great combination for building easy and fast Rise API. You will see how fast that combination than other existing frameworks because of Node.js is a package compilation of Google V8 JavaScript engine and it works on non-blocking and even driven I.O. Express.js is JavaScript web server that has a complete function of web development including Rails API. This tutorial divided into several steps. Step number one, create Express.js application and install required modules. Step number two, add Mongoose.js module SORM for MongoDB. Step number three, create product Mongoose model. Step number four, Creates routes for the REST API endpoint. Step number five, test REST API endpoints. In this tutorial, we will create a node REST API of product data. The products accessible through the Express REST API with the get, pause, put, and delete methods. The Express route from the request of Rails API to the Mongoose query that points to the Mongoose module and proceeds to the MongoDB database. Before we begin, make sure you have installed all the tools that required. Node.js, Express.js, Mongoose.js, MongoDB, Terminal, for Mac or Linux or not command line for Windows, text editor or IDE, we are using Visual Studio Code. You can download and install Node.js easily using the installer, find the recommended version. To check the installed Node.js and NPM, type these commands in the terminal or node command line. Node V or node version is 10.15.1 and PM V. Our NPM version is 6.13.1. Step number one Great Express JS applications and install required modules. We will create Express.js application using Express Generator. For that, install the tools by type this command. sudo npm install express-generator-g. Next, we can create an Express.js app using this command express node race api e this will create express.js projects with the ags view engine because using the a parameter next go to the newly created project folder then install node modules Run the server by type this command. npm start. You will see the log like this in the terminal. Open your browser, then pointing to the local host 3000. If you see the express takes like this, then your server is ready. Stop the running server by press Ctrl and C key. 
Next, you can open this Express.js app using your favorite IDE or text editor. To open this project using Visual Studio Code, simply type these commands from the terminal. Code dot Step number two, add mongoose.js module as ORM for MongoDB. Why using mongoose for MongoDB OGM? Because mongoose provides a straightforward schema-based solution to model your application data. It includes built-in typecasting, validation, query building, business logic, hoax and more out of the box. Next, tap these commands to install the Mongoose JS module. npm i mongoose save. Before running your server again, make sure MongoDB server is running. Open another tab, then type these commands to start MongoDB server, Mongood, back to currently tab. Now, open and edit app.js in the root of project folder using your favorite text editor or IDE. Declare Mongoose in required section. Write a connection to MongoDB. Next, run the Node app again. npm start. If you see the warning like this, you just add this line. Use unified topology is true to the option of Mongoose Connect. Stop and run again the Express.js server. Now we don't have any deprecation warning. Step number 3. Create products Mongoose model. Now create models directory and JavaScript file as the model. Before doing that, stop not server by press the control C MKDR models touch models product js open and edit the product js file then add these lines of codes. This schema will mapping to MongoDB collections called product. Step number four, create routes for the race API endpoint. The race API that we build will have the following functions. To achieve that, add the JavaScript file to the routes folder. Open and edit roads slash products GS, then add these lines of codes. Get all products, get single product by ID, save product, update product, delete product, rotors. Next, open and edit app GS, then add product road as required after user require. Then add the use of the use of users.
Step number five. Test race API endpoints. After everything is ready, this time to testing our created Node.js, Express.js, Mongoose.js, and MongoDB race API. There are so many tools for testing race API, but for now, we are testing using CURL from the terminal. We start with add or save product data first. If you get a response like this, then you save a new product successfully. We can create the same post with different data to populate more records to product collection. Next, we are testing to get all product data using this command. That commands will return a response of products data with JSON format. Next, we are testing to get one product by ID using this command. Next, we are editing and update one of a product by ID using this command. Finally, we are testing to delete one product by ID using this command. That is for now. How to create REST API easily using Node.js, Express.js, Mongoose.js, and MongoDB. You can find the article and source code link in the description below. If you think this tutorial is useful, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel to give us more power to create another video tutorial. Thank you and see you later.